Hi, this is uh, Joe Sanders from Mazak Corp. I'm basically showing you the new spindle health monitoring system. We're trying to make uh, machines smarter and give you a chance to be proactive instead of reactive with your health monitoring of your machine rather than in the past as you crash a machine you don't know if it's good or not until you run a part or you run the spindle up and you hear noise from it. This gives you a chance to basically see the health of your machine in a numerical value and a percentage of life left. From here, you're able to see a different time when the test was run, which is just a, basically a minute time of running the spindle up with a balanced tool and basically running it back down to analyze the health of your spindle. You're looking for unbalanced situations. Uh, un after a crash situation, we're checking to the health of the bearing after that, and then lubrication starvation. Well, basically what happens when a lubrication starvation situation happens, um, you can instantly destroy a spindle within a few minutes of running at that, at that point. If you do this check ahead of time, you'll be able to get the maintenance action put in place and fixed before you destroy the spindle. This also gives you a chance to see um, if we have a situation where we have a degrading spindle that I need to schedule maintenance in so I'm not down for long periods of time. Basically, the basic way we we're using it is we're using taking spindle data in uh, by using vibration and current data. Uh, we're also picking RPM and then we have spindle parameters using AI algorithms developed by UC IMS to basically determine what situation has happened. Lubrication, bearing health, or spindle unbound situation. Overall, it's a very reasonable option. It's actually going to be expandable to move to multiple spindles and to the, to the small screws that eventually give you overall machine health.